everyone, it's the Sound Couple, and we are on the third day in a row of our beginning of summer gigs happening, and today is actually pretty monumental because you can kind of tell from what we're pulling, we are actually using the trailer today, which is something that we have not done in years, and we actually cannot remember the last time that we have pulled the trailer, and partly because a lot of the gigs that we do, it's just kind of nice to have the van because getting in and out of spots with the trailer is not always the most convenient. So we'll see how that works for today and moving well, forward. Part, yeah, I, I think part of it is I came to realize that we our gigs are transitioning. As earlier videos I've mentioned that, you know, we used to do a lot of corporate and weddings and we still do a good share, but We've kind of cycled around and we're back to doing more uh, these outdoor type events which just inherently um, you know we've got some gear growth and, and in conjunction with us needing a little bit more outside um, so epiphany that we were getting away with the band and we still can we actually did last night but we're doing a band that we have not provided production for before I have ran sound for them on health systems and whatnot but we just usually you know when we do these gigs I know exactly what we need to bring and today we're just trying out the trailer again it gives us a little more breathing room and we'll go from there but yeah the trailer's out for the first time in a long time so we'll see you at the gig well, we got in here. It was a bit of a challenge, uh, and hence my trailer apprehensions, but we were able to get, get it through there. It took, apparently these cars aren't not supposed to be parked here, so that took away our access. But we were able to manage to uh, do a lot of some trailer navigation. I, back, I pulled forward and just kept working it to get back here. Quite the, quite the feet. So when we're done here, I'm just gonna end up pretty much coming right, right back here. But yeah, damn, huh? All right, we're gonna get unloaded, get things set up, get busy. See you in a bit.
back. We are set up behind a, or Stacy's behind a wall of mixers and Marshall amps and rack gear. But you guys, we're set up. We're ready to rock. We're in the west. The sun's been brutal, but so I got the CDLs with the two dual subs, two CDLs. We got the 328s. Uh, on monitor world plus center fill. Down here, the, I got two CDL 18s. And it's sandy here, so we tucked them the sheets. And I think tomorrow we'll do a video on how to clean all this gear up. This is what it's looking like tonight. There's probably going to be a big crowd. And uh, Stacy's fan. Got it. All right, we'll check in with you later. Hey Stace. <laughs> hey Bart. What'd you bring? What'd you you brought you brought our uh Oh Yep, right there. Sound couple. Sound couple 101. No 101? No. no how sound. long we just got that like two years ago. Well, I'm saying that if you are new into production or even old into production, 
you this is a must have in your toolkit as far as tear down oh, at night. Okay. Yeah. It's something you don't think about. We'd be we'd be upped. Yeah. We well, we've done it before. We've had to leave, you know, leave the, the light on to the very last. Yeah, but look at all this shit. God. Ugh. Ugh. Guys, this is rough. And and not only that, but tomorrow, I mean, yeah, tomorrow, tomorrow we gotta, dudes, man. I mean, <laughs> Minnesota, but a sand of, ugh, everything is covered in dust. Yeah, we're on a softball field and ugh. bullshit, total bullshit. We gotta take the air compressor and, and go through everything. Ah. Yep. All right, guys, yeah, tomorrow. All right, guys, day after our three day, and now we're gonna go for the big reveal here of how bad is it. It's, it's bad. We got We gotta go through all the gear and Get rid of all this softball crap field. We didn't even bother putting things in the cases knowing that everything was just gonna have to get wiped down. Yeah, I don't think we need to do another one of those again, huh? Nope. So, yeah, lesson learned, charge double if you're gonna be on a softball field because this is gonna be at least a few hours work here, getting all this gear cleaned up. Too nice for that.